Well, hi there. It's our new month of April, so welcome April 1st. Um, today, we are going to be continuing on with All About Sam. Yesterday, we learned that Sam uh, had learned a new word or term called the terrible twos because he heard his mom tell his sister, oh, don't worry, Sam's just in the middle of his terrible twos. That scared him a little bit. He didn't know what the terrible twos were. So he was actually hiding from them, which made us chuckle a little bit. We are going to continue on with some more all about Sam, but first I have our joke of the day. It's a good one for April and spring. Why couldn't the flower ride its bike? Because it lost all of its petals. Oh, boys and girls. Remember, those positive thoughts and that laughter really does help create some positive feelings. That is our positive affirmation for this week. My positive thoughts create positive feelings. Um, maybe tonight with your family, you could get together and take turns saying positive things about each other, saying nice things about um, each person in your family. I bet you'll see each other smiling. I do want to um, continue on with our breath of the day, our happy bubbles. So if you would now take out your bubbles, take your lid off, take your wand and get ready while you're thinking of what happy thoughts you're going to blow into your room right now. So with your wand, take your deep breath. My happy bubbles today were my friends who I've been Zooming with a couple of times. Um, and also I've been noticing the grass is getting really green outside. So that makes us feel good about um, nice weather coming. While we're here, let's do a couple shoulder rolls too because sometimes we've been forgetting about relaxing ourselves. We've been working so hard. So make sure you keep those muscles in your neck relaxed and loose. Let's get ready to enjoy our next installment of All About Sam. If you would be trained, his mother said, buttoning his overalls, you would be a big boy. You could dress yourself and you would never be wet. You wouldn't have to have that box of diapers anymore. Sam thought about that as he scampered away to play with his blocks. He liked that box of diapers. He could stand on it and reach things. There was a lot of interesting stuff in Anastasia's room. On her desk, there were crayons and some chewing gum and a deck of cards with K's and Q's. K's and Q's. Kings and Queens. And a brand new goldfish, Frank the Second, in a bowl. Sam planned on dragging that box of diapers into Anastasia's room someday soon. When no one was looking, he would stand on it and reach the top of her desk. He would do his father's desk, too, because his father had a typewriter. And Sam loved to type stuff. So it made no sense to Sam at all when his mother said that about not having to have that box of diapers anymore. He needed that box of diapers. Still, he was fascinated by the idea of being trained. Sam knew about trains. He had books about trains, and his favorite one was called The Little Engine That Could. Sometimes he made Mom read it to him two times before he went to sleep. I think I can, I think I can, he and his mom would say together then. I thought I could, I thought I could. Sam loved that part the best. So he liked the idea of being trained himself. He stopped saying no when his mother would sigh, and say, I wish you would be trained, Sam. He began saying, maybe. He also began saying chugga, chugga, chugga when he walked down the hall of the apartment. He was practicing being trained. One day, his mother came home from shopping. Sam was playing on the living room floor while he, his father was watching a baseball game on TV. His father was supposed to be watching Sam. Before she left, his mother said, Myron, will you watch Sam while I do the shopping? And his father said, sure. 
but he really hadn't watched Sam at all. He watched a baseball game instead. When his mom came home, she said, Sam, I brought you a present. Animal crackers? Sam asked. Often she brought him a little box of animal crackers. Nope, his mother said. She reached into the bag that she was holding and she pulled out, what do you think it was? It was a little package of training pants. So training pants? That's going to be really confusing for Sam, isn't it? Training pants, some of you might realize, are the pants that um, toddlers would use when they're getting ready to be trained. Hmm. Yep. Mom thinks one thing, training for the potty. Sam thinks another, another type of train, like the kind on the tracks. So you can imagine that tomorrow is going to be really funny and confusing for him. See you next time.